Hello everybody, Ginger Shadow here, and welcome back to some more of the Dragon Block Mod Pack with the Mia. Ha 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 ha. Can you see the beacon? Oh god. So, um, math may have been a bit wrong. I forgot how the beacon stuff works. We made a beacon thinking, oh, that'll be good. That'll help with training. Then we realised, oh, if we get a full beacon, aka all four layers, that'll mean we're able to have haste too on our punching, which might even be even more helpful. It might not be, but you know, maybe more helpful. I'm like, okay, how many block speeds? So I thought, right, okay, so there's a, a three layer, then a four, or five, and then there's a, a six layer. No, no, that's not how it works because it has to go one out each side. Meaning it's a, a 3, then a 5, then a 7, then a 9. So it's not just 9 blocks, then 16, then 25, then 36. Well, I thought it was. No, 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 no. It's a 9, then a 25, then a 49, then an 81. <laughs> so yeah, it's, it's not going to be easy getting all that iron, is it? So I think for now, I'll just stick to using the, the haste one, to be honest. Because <laughs> hell's. Yeah, it's going to take a while to get. The rest of that, uh, I'll probably get it in due time. Anyway, been training as you do, trying to figure out what the hell I'm going to do to try and, you know, make up the difference against the likes of Kale and stuff. Because, um, yeah, we decided last time we're not going to fly anymore when fighting people for the term of the power arc. Great idea, until you realise the absolute slaughter is. I mean, I was doing pretty good against Kale until she launched a giant ass attack and murdered me. So, um,. There's that. I've been trying to think of what countermeasures can I make up for that. I've got a couple of ideas, other than just, you know, straight up in my stats. I'm trying to think of what other strategies I can employ, because as much as just up in my stats is a tactic, well, that's going to get even harder fights as we've got to like to have some ways of maybe countering situations. I've been a bit of a pickle against some of this stuff for quite a while, so let's see what we can do, I suppose. Right. Ah, oh, first we'll do whitelisting. We'll do that really quick. We'll go from there. So right, whitelisting. Ba -ba -dum. If you're a member and you have to go on, you should now be whitelisted. Modpack, if you're not, should be on Discord and Dragon Block Project Room, where it belongs. Oh, and that one person added to the whitelist from the comments section. That one person is uh, Dragon Block Twenty One. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ah, uh, you've been added to the whitelist. Modpack, if you're not, again, should be on Discord, where it belongs in the Dragon Block Project Room. And as always, people, if you want to get a chance to get whitelisted onto the server, leave a like on the video, I'll get a game down below for a chance to go on. And as always, the more likes in the video, the more people I shall whitelist. Now, what are we going to do? Well, I've been training for one. I've been getting more points. And obviously, all that will arc up oh, my mind. Because that seemed like a good thing to do. So, yeah, being busy. And, um... Temptations there just to max out. I mean, at this point, I have the biggest of big brains, but over. Uh, so I did that. I deleted a uh, defense penetration. It was doing nothing for me. I think deleting fly and just getting it back to level one is probably a good idea because if I'm not using it and don't need it for fights, then that's just 10 speed. Uh, like, that's just 10 like main points I just don't need to put in there. So we're probably going to do that really quick. And I'm going to go visit the cat. Oh, wait, no, the cat too. Oh, yeah, the cat too. Shadow fly. Corin! Teach me how to fly again. I may have forgotten. Why have I forgotten? Good question. Late fly? Yes. Corin. Learn to fly. Yes. There we go. So right, my fly speed goes down by 8%. Which is a shame. But I don't need it there, do I? Like, I'm not I'm not using it against fights anymore. And even when I was using it, I don't know if it was making that big a difference because I was still getting hammered by the big techniques anyway. So, it's one of those ones really, isn't it? Also, how's my armor looking? Yeah, everything's perfect. Yeah, yeah, okay, I've repaired it. I repaired it in due time. Right, um... Oh, man, what else are we going to do? Well, running and jumping is important. That is a consideration. Not my problem is, I don't know how big the biggest hacks are. <laughs> Because of this stupid new key system. I wish you could change it back to the old one at this point. Because at least that... Like, it, maybe, it's, maybe, maybe people like the new textures a bit more. But I prefer, you know, the ball being the size it's meant to be. And thus you can tell where it is, where it's going to hit. And if you've dodged it. But they're deceptively like small those ones. Because their hitbox thing is still the same size. They just look more compact. And it's really annoying. Oh. So there's that. That's a thing to think about. Gulp. Uh, I've got this, the barrage. I'm having a think about that. Like, 
I don't think that can stop a big attack. But I'm not sure. Because, like, I don't think I've ever tried launching against their big attack, but I'm wondering if it would get swallowed by it or whether it would just, like, delay it. I don't know. It's something to think about. I may have to try using Barrage as an option. Other than that, I've been having to think of, well, what else can I do? Shields. I don't typically use shields because they tend to fail and stuff, but... And, like, obviously my, you know, my willpower is not exactly great, so I'm going to expect a shield I make to be very, very good. But, look, when I transform, the damage I can output with my key attacks is... I don't know if it's around about where theirs is, but, like, yeah, it, it does. It is there. I wonder if I make a full power barrier if it could protect me against their attack. Something to try out, I suppose, before I get inevitably killed. Um, so, yeah, that's a thought. Now, other than that, yeah, the dash and jump skill. Which is weird that I'm even having to consider it, but... <sighs> the ability to jump higher and the ability to dash quicker does also seem like it'd be a very useful thing at this point. So I need to really think about how I want to distribute my points at this point. So, I've got 120 mine to play with. Um, at least 30 is going to be useful for Ultra Instinct, but I don't need to put it in that right now. Because I'm not going for Master Ultra Instinct right now anyway. So I can leave, I can probably leave that where it is. I can probably spend some of these points. A key boost of meditation would be good to get more points than that. But, they're like, uh, yeah, key boost is handy. But yeah, they, like meditation, I'm not using that actively in battle. I'm not standing still in battle to charge. So that doesn't really matter. Learn skill. The dash skill. Right now, I my run speed is 150. If I transform. This is that Kyle Ken triggering there. No, it's not. Why did Cal Ken think shop that? that? was weird. Um, my run speed's up to 180. I forgot to Kyle Ken. What's my max run speed? Oh, wait, hold on. Oh, full power turn. Full power! Let's see what we're looking like. My max speed's 240%. So 150 in base, 240. The now. My jump is not fantastic by any stretch. I don't know how big a boost jumping that give, but they're not very expensive, so I kind of want to try them out and see. Oh, it does drain my hunger a bit, though. That is a thing. Right, okay, let's, 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 let's start with dash. Running. Wait. Oh yeah, it was a 240. So we're up from 240 to 247. Okay, and I assume each level is going to give an R7%. So I can get it up to 310. So that's a pretty big boost. Okay, cool. Right now, I can jump... Where am I jumping height to? Ugh. About about up to there. Not quite able to get on there, but you know, pretty good. Alright, but then when I'm running and jumping, it's taking a bit to get that. Alright. God, I'm draining some of my hunger really quick. Uh, if I get the jump skill really quick. Can I make it to that ledge? I fucking can as well. <laughs> okay, so my jump's just got a little oomph to it there as well. Cool. Uh, do I have... Do I have healing water with me that I could use here somewhere? Um, like, yeah, feck it, he'll do. I see the wee pool to chill out in for a second. No, 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 put that there. Pop that there. No, no, it's a half slap. Oh, no, 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 put that there. Sorted. Oh, there we go. Gets my energy back really quick. Gets my hunger back really quick. God, I'm actually considering jumping and running skill at this point. I'm wondering which one to invest in. I'm going to... Pretty much, I can play a bit with them. They don't cost a lot. Like, if I put... Obviously, it's the mind that takes a bunch of them, and the mind could obviously be better used somewhere else. But I can delete them later, and re-add them and stuff, and play about with them as I want to. They're not too big a deal. Like, increasing a dash cost me five points. Like, from my TP. So, yeah, I'll put... Dash up to level four. And jump up to level four. That gets my run speed up to 270%. Why? Why 270? It's not any quicker in turbo. Why 270? Shouldn't be 270. Should be 275. 
Oh, God. Oh, yeah, I'm jumping way higher than that. <laughs> oh, that's been a massive difference. Oh, I'm very bouncy now. Oh, I like this. Ah, oh, all right. That's... Can I get over a big attack with that, though? I've got more points to spend. I might as well... Yeah, put up to five. Let me go up there. Urgh. Oh, I bloody can as well. Like... Uh, not quite reaching there. Yeah, that's... Pretty good. Alright. I'm like... I don't know if it like, doubled my height jump or something. Like... Okay, not quite doubled, but like, you know, I've added a couple of blocks on. Oh, yeah, every every level of jump adds like a block on then. That makes sense. I want to believe this will be enough. Like, the speed in jump-wise, this might be enough to help me keep up with kill in the big blast. As long as I'm really quick and careful about it. <laughs> I can't believe this is what it's come to. It's such a basic skill. But it's, like, it's so necessary for what we need right now. Ah, right, I'll keep those extra 20 points just for in case I want to put them in jumper or uh, something like that. Mate. Right, other than that, what else do I want to spend points on? Probably my stats, if I'm being honest. Uh, let's power down. Uh, ba -ba there we are. Right, what can I put points in? I've got enough for quite a bit, actually, as it turns out. Good, good. Um, Let's see, what are we putting points in? Ooh, do, 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 do. I feel like points in Constitution. Uh, that was annoying. Uh, points in Constitution. Yep. Points in Dexterity. Points in Spirit. I actually could put more points in Mind if I really wanted to. That is an option. Now, something else I was having to think about. Willpower. Does that affect things? Because, like, Key Infuse. The skill Key Infuse allows you to infuse Key into projectiles, thus increasing their damage. Each uh, gives 0.5% uh, damage. From the uh, actually obviously that's at full right now, so it's supposed to give an extra five percent damage based on my uh, willpower attribute. Does that mean if I increase my willpower, that'll increase the power of my scythe? That's what I'm wondering, because technically I feel like that's what's being implied there. Like, cause if I whip, if I whip my scythe out right now, it gives me it does like no extra damage, but if I transform and use my scythe, it does way more damage. And of course it does. When I'm transformed, I get a bunch more willpower. I'm kind of, I'm curious if that is a thing that would help. I don't want to increase my willpower massively, but I am wondering if, like, I will, I mean, I also don't know if willpower will affect anything else. Err. Uh, it's something I want to check. I didn't really care about willpower before, but it is something I'd like to check. I'd have to increase it by a massive amount, but even just increasing it a small amount would increase my damage without increasing the cost of energy for it. That could be pretty handy. Right, let's head back to... Let's head back home now. Open. Right. So right now if I pick a fight, with obviously a shadow, I do 140 odds. Or 164, sorry. With key fist on, I do 741. Nice. If I had a key weapon that one, though, Makes no difference. Now, I don't know if that's just because... Um, thingy. My willpower is that low. That it's not providing any extra power. Because if I go here... Uh... Keeper, 125. Ah, it should put a point in then. If it's 5%, it should put at least one point in. Ah, oh, this feels like it could be a massive waste. But I kind of want to try it. Yeah, anyway, if we put this away, we transform. Go away, Kaioken. Super Sage in blue. But we're off, zombies! It's so, alright. With Key Fist. Not oh, Friendly Fist. Key Fist off. I do 651. With it on, I do 1283. You can die now. Yeah, so 1283. With the key weapon, I do 13.28. And with this, I do 15.28. Die, please. Right! 
If I increase willpower by 10, will that affect anything? Becomes a question. Well, uh, it should. If it affects the stat at all, it should. Do I, do I care about No, actually, what I'm saying all this, I don't care. <laughs> I was debating if it's worth it to increase my key, the power of my scythe a bit more. But you know what? You know what? I just I don't care. I'd rather put those points in defense. Screw it. I was thinking about it there. No, no. I'm staying on this path of low power and maximum. Even if it is extra free power, I feel like there's going to be a downside somewhere. Right. Hells to it. What are we doing now then? Um. I want to put more points in things. More constitution. Can I still fit in the pod? I assume I can at low percentage. Oh, no, I still can at 100. Oh, cool. <laughs> oh, I can still fit. Fantastic. Right. That'll give me more stamina to work with. That'll give me more health. I'll put me up to 6,000. Noise. Uh, where am I at on key? My energy could all come back. Power it down. There we go. Battle power 4,336,640. Noise. Key power 9,240. Cool. Um, I'll put 20 more points in. I'll put 20 more points in things. Uh, I could just put them in mind and up my, my dash skill a bit more. <laughs> or my jump skill a bit more. Oh, nah, I need, the, I need the dexterity. I need the dexterity. Dexterity up. I'll, I'll keep 100,000 extra for using later. Or by using later, I mean saving up for when I decide to up my ultra instinct, which is going to be expensive, but... With the amount of training I can get done, and the amount of time, well, it still takes ages, but, like, the amount of training I can get done, like, it's not as mental now. When you get mined at 900, you're getting 20 points per good punch. Plus, with the haste added on, I don't think it's helping, but I feel like it's helping, which is motivating, at the very least. <laughs> but, yeah, uh, with getting 20 per punch thing, like, it's a, it's a lot easier getting a higher level of points than what it was. Because, obviously, that's... Me, I'm basically fight, um, basically training at 10 times efficiency than what I was when I first started. Oh, I don't even know what I think about how, it took, how many hours it took to get here. But here we are. <laughs> right, right, the last thought process. A shield. I'm not using the chaos bombs. We're going to unlearn that. We're going to create a shield. How much does a shield cost? Obviously, we want it to be a full power. Effect? I don't really know what the effect of a shield is. So I'm just going to say no. I don't care. And I'm also going to make it red. And... Chaos Shield. Might as well. Uh, but, but, uh, I don't know if it's going to help, but I'm willing to give it a try. Although, downside being... It's going to be a pain upgrade. Unless I have someone to use Barrage on me, it's going to be a real pain upgrade. How long does it take to use... Oh, far too long. Far too long. They just shot me down dead by now. Obviously, the, the amount it's at the nose is obviously not very good. But, like, yeah, it'll obviously get a bit stronger. And I'll hopefully bigger. As, um, are we going to get bigger? I suppose I've increased the size, though. Okay, well, I want us to charge time massively up. Ugh. Well, it would be helpful if I brought Yami on the train on it. I don't want to right now. <laughs> Ugh. Okay, maybe the barrier is not a good idea for today. I think for today I'll try the barrage tactic. The barrier might be useful later on. If I can get a barrier that's quick to deploy, maybe that could be useful later down the line. Yeah, alright. Put barrage up the top. Put the barrier in second. I never normally move these around, but hills to it. Also, feck all zombies. Da -da -da -da. There we are. Yeah, I don't feel that much slower. Oh, okay. God, it's snowing. No! The ring doesn't get covered in snow because these blocks don't let things on them, which people are saying maybe that's why uh, it acts the way it does. Like, it doesn't let mobs spawn on it. And they try to spawn below. It's because of the type of block it is. Could be. Typically, yeah, it was pointed out these blocks are normally associated... Why has someone done that? It's uh, These blocks are normally associated with safe zones. So, eh... I can see the logic there, why that would mean, yeah, you don't really want things spawning on them, so they're made with blocks that don't allow the spawns, but... Well, I guess that means the kitchen blocks you can put stuff on, like, or, or snow can settle on them, sort of thing. As I was there trying to charge up my key, thinking I had to go higher, not realizing 9,240 is the amount we're going for. 
Right, well, anyway, we've done some prep. Played a bit of my stats more. We've gotten the most basic ass of skills ever, but here we are. The skill dash allows you to run faster and gives the ability to dodge left to right. Back in... Uh, yeah, we're not ever doing that. Uh, you can turn dodges off in the action menu. Jump. Jump allows you to jump higher. It also gives you fall damage protection if fallen less than 100 blocks. But with fly, you have perfect fall damage. Well, no, you don't. Not when your key runs out. Does that helps when your key runs out. I'm pretty sure that just turns off as well. Right, never mind. Time to do things. Uh, we're going to transform. Full power. Let's see if this makes a difference. So, to know, I will be hitting harder because I've got my key up. My damage should be up as well. So that's the thing. How did my key draining? 98. For my form, maintaining. That's not too bad. And I lose 42 still from. Oh! That goes up to 420. Wait, is that where it's getting it from? Oh! It takes a tenth of whatever your strength stat is. Does it? Hold on. I want to test this. So right now, yeah, it's at 50. If I go Kaioken, I'll go up to 100. So at that point, I'll lose 10, right? Is that how it's working? Come on. Come on. No, it's still 42. Right, never mind. <laughs> I don't understand the logic behind all this, but whatever, it's still 42. I, I saw the number match up and thought for a second I'd understood the logic. So originally I thought, no, it's taking whatever the number, your original number is taking my 50. No, that doesn't seem to be either. What, whatever, doesn't matter. Let's fight, let's fight, let's fight. God damn bloody snow. Oh, I should put string them. I'll just end up breaking it. Okay, no, I don't think it matters. I don't think it matters. I don't think it's going to matter. Right, let's do the thing. Kill time for a rematch. Now it's time for a rematch. I'm not. I'm starting with Barrage. Ugh. Right, okay. That hurt a bit. That was just a little one, right? Run. Okay, yeah. Uh oh. Okay, yeah, that's just a little one. Run, run, run! Ow, 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 ow! Woo! -hoo -hoo. That hurt quite a bit as well. Her teleporting antics are very painful. Also, the snow's not helping as it turns out. Uh, I still get hit by that. Also, I've got that in my inventory. Go away. Uh. Okay, so I can... Got hit by that there. Need to dodge, need to dodge, need to dodge. Dodged! Right, okay, now. Yep, felt that one coming, right, cool. It goes behind, that's quite annoying. Ah! Okay, well I can tank it, I can, I can take that hit. Coming, yep, there it is. Okay, yep, get ready, get ready, and jump! And no, I didn't tank that right at all, cool. Uh, I did one. Oh god, I lost something. That's just a little one. I'm getting a sense of being. Oh god, right, launch big one. No, it's just little. It's a barrage again. Oh god. Stop! Ow! How are you hitting me with these? <laughs> I know I'm close, but like. Why do you jump forward when I do that? Okay, that was that one. Yep, I can take that. Why does she jump forward? It's quite annoying, if I'm being honest. <laughs> right, eat the meat, eat the meat. And run! Jump! Ah! Oh, I did dodge that somehow. I don't know how. Yeah, she jumps forward. Why? I don't know why she does it, but it's annoying. <laughs> Ah! The snow is not making this easy, by the way. Oh god, I'm really close. I don't like it. Oh, yeah, there we go. Okay, it's a barrage. Yep, alright. Oh, it was on my little one. 
Uh. Snare barrage. Okay, tank a barrage. It, it drains my stamina as well as the barrage. Oh, there we go. She's one hit away. Oh, that was her hit. No! I'd let it put out how that worked there. Um, her punch didn't kill me originally. So, there was that. But, after I killed her, I stopped moving. But she didn't die straight away. When they die, they can still hit you one last time. Because the, the, the wee time thing for the punch comes back. And I stopped blocking as well, but I had too low a health anyway. So, yeah, literally, she punched me as I beat her. And, uh I still won. Like, yeah, I still, I still won, but, like, she got a snide punch at the end there. <laughs> oh, god damn it! Look, I won that fight. Well, that's the main thing. I won the fight. I'm able to dodge the big attacks sometimes. Not perfectly. They're still pretty big and annoying, but I'm able to, I'm able to dodge them. I'm able to tank hits better, you know, get better defenses. Doesn't feel like it, because I'm getting slaughtered still, but, you know, I managed a bit better. My key management, not exactly great. The scythe drains a hell of a lot. But, you know, it does damage. It does work. Uh, I can't believe she got a stick. If I'd moved away after hitting her, by the way, I would have been fine. It's literally because I stood still. I just, I was so relieved to be finished in that. I didn't even think about it. Right, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to quickly, oh, I'm going to wait for... Thingy's timer has run out, and then yeah, we'll head we'll head back in there. Uh, we'll, we'll head back and we'll continue on. Even if technically it's not the most satisfying of victories against Kill, it's still a victory. We carry on. I am free. Da done. Oh, I did consider they're going to King Kai's to try and do some training, but I hate the trainer that's over there. <laughs> like it's it's the one that's supposed to push the guys in front of you, but they still hit me part of the time. I I just don't like it. I don't like it. I like I like the current one. That I use. I, I think it's superior, to be honest. Ah, right, we drew with kill, sort of, but it counts as my victory because she's not back again. So I fight to protect. Brianna tries to take you out with a sneak attack that missed. Oh, we're fighting Brianna now, are we? Alright. <laughs> I can't imagine she's going to be stronger. Like, I just can't. I can't imagine she's going to be stronger than kill. Because she probably shouldn't be. Guess we'll see. Ah, oh, right, okay. Uh, let's power up again, because things... Oh, I need to go to cat. Get. Cat. Give me thing. Ba-da. There we are. And head back to the arena now. Lovely jubbly. Oh, right. Get my power back up again. Powered up. I like I said, try and hold back against Brian, but I really can't afford to hold back against anyone because everyone just seems to be freakishly stronger <laughs> than what I remember them being. Oh. Well, what I remember them being in the show by comparison to other people, anyway, but here we are. Right, Brianna can, I can't really tell what level Brianna's at as well. Like, she got her ass kicked by Android 18, but then she was fighting against Super Saiyan Blue Folk, but Super so inconsistent was powerless scaling and stuff that... <laughs> just can't tell. Just can't tell. Right, we'll go full power nonetheless, because it might as well. Uh, ba -ba 102,000, right, power. Brian, This should not be as difficult, right? If I remember correctly from the review... Yeah, Brianna's only get 60,000. Ow. Ow, ow, ow! Oh, oh god, no, not again! No! Ow, no! ran at the barrage I forgot <laughs> I forgot you've got to be within 10% of your health <laughs> I forgot about all that oh, I just got back I dropped my guard I, I just saw Brianna just thought lol 
I'm going to beat you easily. And, like, she's not as strong as Ziller. She's not, but... Yeah, when I run into the barrage, I just didn't back away early enough. <laughs> right? Anyway, I'm gonna wait some more time. And then I'm gonna come back and kick Brianne's ass for that. That's a bit embarrassing, but here we are. This is one of those things. Ta -dun, ta -dun, ta -dun, ta -dun, ta -dun. Come on, come on, come on! <laughs> Ah, I've spent 20 minutes in Afterlife this episode. This is not cool. <laughs> Revive! <laughs> right, back again we go. Cat! Cat, cat, cat. Give us a bean. What do you mean I can't get a bean? Apparently the day's not passed yet. Right, okay, let's try this again. <sighs> we beat... We drew with Kale, and then we lose to Brian. I. It's insulting to think about. <laughs> like we had that fight so easily, just fucking ran into the barrage a bit too hard. Also, mate, three stock. Better. Right. Kaioken. No power, no mercy. We're not losing this time. Eh. It's a corner. I'm getting a bit stuck there. Right, get my energy back, bam, ba -dum, and we're off. I'll tell you guys, I can actually fly over to this bit. It's okay to fly over to this bit. Right, full power. Oh, no, hold on. Not quite full power. Never at full power. Right, let's try this again. Ah, it took two hits there. Don't use fly. Okay, yep, there we go. So, Brian still hits reasonably hard. And it's just a big attack. And apparently that hit there. No, no, it didn't hit me. It did hit the bit behind me though, Oh, So, ow! Brian. No! Not again! No! 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 Ow! Damn it! Not again! Also, just want to say a quick thank you to all of the channel members for the extra support. Any special thank you and shout out to our elite members, the Johnny members, Austin Quinzenberry, Marshall F, Javis Baker, Platius, Afrokagi, and It's Ender Steve P. And our army members are Robert Simeka, Rapids Rogue, Shadow Wolf, Aragon, and Gold Dragon. Thank you all very much for the extra awesome support. Butter, butter, butter.